Alright, so they definitely went through here. Oh my god. He's pissed. No! If I made that, bro, that would have been sick. Proof fired the crap out of them. Okay. Okay. Just clear out their whole team for you guys. You can thank me later. He's camping over here. Kill him, teammate. Oh my god. Two, three, one, and I get sniped. Ah, on everybody you already know who it is it is your boy the dryer newt here coming at you guys with another youtube video and today i'm going to be teaching you how to aim with the aug now with the aug it is a really strong smg and you got to use and play with your strength or the gun strengths and what you want to do is you want to play to that medium just find the sweet spot the medium to close range it does well at close range it does well at long range but this gun really excels at medium to close range range and the reason why it's not the best at close range is because the fire rate is kind of slow but it puts out a ton of damage so what you're going to want on it is the optic the gi mini reflex because when you are aiming you really want to have a clear sight picture and the iron sights on this gun is pretty good but i just prefer the gi mini reflex the stock we are using the forge tack cqb comb Basically what this stock does is it just helps out with our ADS speed. The aiming stability pretty much is when you're aiming how much idle sway you get. Um, we are running the 5.56 NATO rounds. This is also helps out with the damage and range. Like I said, medium to close range, this gun is really good. So you're gonna be running the 30 round mags. Now with this gun, you have to be really accurate. And I highly suggest you guys play with this one because it doesn't hurt your ADS speed. If you go to the 60 round magazine, your ADS speed is gonna suck. It really slows down the movement of this gun. So this gun is really, you gotta be really accurate and it's a really good gun to learn how to be accurate. It has, it has minimum recoil with this class setup, so it really does help out. The Merc 4 grip helps with the movement speed. You get a 10% movement speed, recoil control, hip fire accuracy. So when you're up close, you can just hip fire people instead of waiting to ADS. Now it kind of cripples your movement speed, but with this gun, we're gonna be running specialist. And with specialist, you get a movement bonus when you get on your specialist bonus. So we're running that monolithic suppressor, always, always, almost run a suppressor on every class. Helps you stay off the radar, especially when you're going, rushing and getting into their spawn and that is what you're going to want. Um, you don't want to be, get shown up on the radar or anything like that. The sexy Damascus camo. Secondary is your preference. Now for the kills or the perks, you're going to want to run quick fix. Always run quick fix. If you're rushing around like me, you guys know I get clips. Quick fix, basically what it does is it really helps you. After you get a kill, you start healing almost instantly. 
quick fix is a must on this class. Go stay off the radar. Tune up, I run dead silence. And what tune up does is it reduces the charge by 40%. So you get your dead silence almost after two or three kills every time. It really helps out. Next, you wanna run scavenger because we're going on long streaks. You wanna pick up ammo. Always wanna have that high alert. Since we're rushing into the spawn, what high alert does is it flashes wherever the enemy is looking at you. So they could be flashed to your left, to your right, up, back, or below you. And that tells you where the enemy is looking at you. So all you gotta do is flick on to that direction. And if you have map awareness, you pretty much know where they're camping at. Battle Harden. Battle Harden is a must. What it does is it reduces the um, flashbangs, EMP, and gas effects, and your immune to snapshot grenades. Snapshot grenades, uh, people don't really run those, but this is what you need if you're playing on mouse and keyboard, because we all know how long a stun can last, and you cannot move when you are using a mouse and keyboard. So this is the class setup, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Always remember to stay blessed and stay humble, and I'll catch you guys in another one. Peace. All right, guys, it looks like we have a really tough match ahead of us. We'll see how we can do. Pre-aim every corner. And not reload out in the open like that. Yikes. Holy, that LMG. All right, where are they gonna be at? I spawned right in front of him, holy. Gotta get the tags. Oh. Nice. That was bad. Enemy who have. That was close. Ah, oh, I should have known he was going to throw that. There wasn't much I could do though, but make my shots hit. All my shots hit that time. They're all gonna come through here. That should have been the death. Okay, they were just waiting now. 10 kills. MP7s, huh? You bet I can hit my shots. I don't even need to move. Oh, I should have moved. <laughs> All right, teammate. This stuff on the cluster. Kill him. Guys, they're gonna be spawning right over here. Be on your toes. Stuff, teammate. And that is what you do. Kill this guy. 
and oh he sniped me nice snipe dude i didn't even know he had a sniper i would have pushed that not bad all right we took the lead that's all i really care about i saw your little head bro my teammate got a veto he's going off bro keep it up brother You love to see it. That beetle is going to protect me. Okay. I'm dead. these tight angles I saw him headshot 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 Our teammates got this. GG 31 defeat the boys. Let's go. Oh, that was a good game. We got a teammate. Jeez. GG guys. GG everyone. GG.